The winner moving on to Orlando in the Pro Bowl for the Madden 18 Club Championships up in Orlando in Central Florida the end of January and it will be Blocky with the rock kicking off and he's receiving there and he gets the ball first first down and 10 for Blocky he's rocking that color rush jersey orange on orange hmm. Gusto in the aqua there on defense first down and 10 for Blocky Abbott Lopez at his own 23 yard line he's got the gun bunch Fakes it to his running back, looking. Oh, be careful Ooh. there, and it's knocked down by Gusto. Good job there. So first pass incomplete for Gusto, Dave. Well, tip drill off the foot there at the end of that. Yeah, I'm interested to see. You know, we saw in the second half of the semifinal game, Blocky had to adjust his scheme a little bit. He had to run the ball, big lead, wanted to clock this thing out. I think we're going to see TJ Logan fade back into the background during this game. We are going <laughs> to see Blocky air the ball out. Gusto on defense, he needs to also make some adjustments. You know, he's obviously, everybody knows about Vic, but when he's on defense, he needs to find a way to slow down this passing attack coming out of bunch for Blocky. Gusto spent most of his money, has capped the 750 points on DBs, and Mike Vic, right now we'll see what those DBs can do. Oh, he couldn't get up, and it's a great completion there on the corner route to Brandon Cooks. Aaron Rodgers hits Brandon Cooks, and that picks up a first down there, a first and 10 around the 44-yard line. Good pitching catch there, Dave. Yeah, no, a really nice job of picking up that blitz, making the line adjustments, blocking the back, and waiting for the corner route to get open. Very nice. Again, nice job of picking up the rush. He's got the go open over the There's middle. A There's a dot Deshaun, Deshaun Jackson yep. coming across with that dead route across the middle there. And Rodgers now three or four, 45 yards, Dave. Looking good early on for blocking. Looking very good. And he's got Deshaun Jackson, Brandon Cooks, Tyree Hill. So much speed on the yes. outside for him. A lot, a lot of speed at the wide receiver position. And, you know, the guy throwing them the ball, Aaron Rodgers. That's the key. Yeah, he's pretty good. Lord he's cap pretty on his receivers. decent. Pretty decent. More cap on the receivers, but he says, Larry, they're fast. And I said, you know, that's great. I, I agree with that. Look, if I'm going to spend my money, I want a good secondary, maybe a good defensive line, and give me a really good quarterback, and just give me some fast receivers. Maybe they can get open. It's kind of hard to throw in Madden 18, uh, comparatively speaking, to Madden 17. So I like how he dispersed the salary cap there. Second down and 10. Rodgers takes uh -oh. off. He's going to be brought down there. Gain of about two or three. It'll be third down and seven for Blocky on the move. I felt that big hit coming off the right. I was. I know that. Uh, I know that uh, Miami man was. Or excuse me. I know that. Uh, Gusto. Gusto. Thank you. Excuse me. Was uh, was waiting for that big hit stick right there. Blocky back in that West Coast gun bunch week. Third down and seven. Aaron Rodgers. He's had got B. Got X. If he wants it, he's going to take, take off. off and run, and he take can have off. that as well. Dives for two carries, 12 yards there, first down and 10. He's near the red zone or the green zone. He's inside of the green zone uh, at Gusto's, we'll call it the 17, 18-yard line. First down and 10, back in the gun bunch. Logan on the right-hand side, offset. Aaron Rodgers looking. He's got Lovato there, taken down inside the 10, around the 6 or the 5-yard line. First and goal for Blocky, Dave. Nice read. Take what's given to him. Checks it down to his tight end. Gets inside the 10. That's exactly what you want to do. This has been a very solid, consistent, balanced drive here for Block. Even though he's throwing the ball a lot, he's shay he's mixing up his route combos. He's mixing up going deep versus going on the shorter routes. Red zone offense switched it up to the single back ace. There you saw uh, Logan with the one off the right-hand side. Tackled made by Micah Hyde for Gusto. Second down and goal. No gain there for Logan. Back in the gun bunch. Compressed field. Going to be hard to complete passes. There you see it flips it back on the right-hand side. Logan offset to the left-hand side. Second down and goal. Rodgers, he's got a receiver. Brandon Cooks on the corner Beautiful. route, and that's a dot right there. Touchdown. Feet were in, and he is on the board there. First possession, first score of the game. Blocky up 6-0, pending that PAT, Dave. Beautiful, beautiful patience right there. He had drag routes over the middle. Couldn't try to force a ball in right there. Let that corner route develop. Really, really nice pass. That's exactly what you wanted from your first drive for Blocky right there. Absolutely. Point after attempt, up and good. Ten plays or seven plays, uh, 75 yards there uh, for Blocky. Gets it into the end zone. He's got the early 7-0 lead. Gusto uh, with the rock now here live at Hard Rock uh -oh. Stadium. Fumbles that thing, picks it up there. Oh, he trips. Oh, stays on his feet. Can reverse his field. No, he's going to run into a couple of tacklers there from Blocky. First down and 10 for Gusto. A little uneven start uh, yeah, there Yeah, not, not the way you necessarily <laughs> want to kick off that drive, but, you know, Gusto's going to have to, to answer right here. And, and really, this is going to be the, the test of the game right here is whether Blocky can stop Vic and stop this offense. I'm interested to see if, if Gusto's going to any kind of trickery, any kind of something different, because right now it looks like he's spreading the field out. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. 
bunch, quads, that indie playbook there for Gusto. First down and 10. Mike Vick barking signals, takes off up the middle. Blocky ready for it there. Good job there. One rush, negative one yard there. Second down 11. Back on the line of scrimmage quickly for Gusto. Bunch quads. Vick in the gun, barking out signals there. Got four receivers to the left. Three of them come back to the right. Bunch quads to the right now. Second down and 11. Mike Vick takes off, spins, and has no room there. Blocky doing a good job with that 3-3-5 Chiefs defense. And right there, I mean, those first two plays of this game for, for Gusto on defense, that's better defense against Vic than we've seen all day. You know, he clearly has made some adjustments. He's clearly done his homework. Yes. He, he really has, uh, has, has, has not been surprised by this Mike Vick so far. Well, Gusto said it after that first semifinal. He said, look, if you want to beat me, you're going to have to stop Mike Vick. Didn't spend a whole lot of time labbing. Doesn't know a lot about the competitors. He's just focused on his game. He's got a receiver. Oh, drop there. He had the receiver in front of them. High low their action with those two crossers. And he went to the deep dig and was not able to complete it. Fourth down and 12 already. A very big fourth down for Gusto. Yeah, right? I think he's going to punt this. Yeah, he is going to punt this. He's going to trust the defense. Not a typical Madden competitive player move, but he is on his own 12-yard line. Even for a Madden player, that's really giving up too much field position if you don't convert that thing. Fourth and 12. And as I say that, he's got a he fake shakes and he it up. Oh, he overshot him. He had him. Oh, what a... I can say ballsy, yeah. right? <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is. That's what it was. I mean, it really was. That was something oh, that man. really, really caught caught Blocky off guard there. Sure was did. not able to execute. Got to get that pass accuracy up for his punter. Who knew? Who wow. knew? Colton Schmidt, you know, going go to the air right there. But Aaron Rodgers got room, takes yep. off slides there, dude. And you know what Blocky's doing right now? He's running Gun Bunch really, really well. He does something that Skimbo does really well out mm -hmm. of Gun Bunch, which is he drops back, he makes his read. If he can roll out, he will. If not, he's tucking and running. Tucking and running. Aaron Rodgers, not, not a running quarterback necessarily, but he is mobile enough to make Gusto, or Gusto keep him honest on that. Second down and seven for Blocky, getting the ball back on that failed fourth down pass there from Gusto. Logan off the left-hand side. Had a great game, about 100 yards last game. Off to a slow start on this game, as you can see that Miami Dolphins inspired controller right there. That's Things awesome. look beautiful there, the Xbox controller. The fans to the left, fans <laughs> to the right. Go ahead, Dolphins, do the fans there thing right go. there. Some Jimmy Buffett fans in the house tonight, all right. <laughs> Miami's got the Dolphins, the greatest football team. <laughs> Third down and eight for Blocky here at Hard Rock Stadium. He's got a receiver, Brandon Cooks. I like how he puts the perfect ball placement there inside of the one-yard line. First and goal, Blocky on the move. Beautiful use of that possession catch as well. That's him holding down that A button to make sure his receiver is not trying to get extra yards. He's not trying to make an aggressive catch. Nice and easy. Get down to the basically the half-yard line right here. Going from the shotgun, that's a, that's, that's a nice little Madden move right there. You don't see that very often in the NFL. When you're way down here, it looks like he's going to let this thing clock down, actually, at the end of the first Absolutely. quarter. Absolutely. Saw UCF last week against uh, USF, Central Florida and South Florida. Uh, victory formation in the shotgun. Well, there Never you go. seen that ever before. Okay, that's a new the, one the, on the, me the as well. The best play yeah. in all of football is the victory formation, and they were in the shotgun. That tells you where the game of football is gone, where uh, you get in the shotgun to kneel the ball down. <laughs> I'm like, what, what are they doing? But, you know, Scott Frost and those guys, guys doing a great job up in Orlando, 12 and 0. American Athletic Conference champions uh, going to the Peach Bowl in Atlanta. Uh, Scott Frost taking the job in Nebraska. That's right, it's a big hire for Nebraska. That's, that's, that's a good one. Second and go. Right? We mentioned during the semifinal, you know, sneak D, a really, really important essential part of any red zone defense. You saw right there, A-Rod went for it, got stuffed. I'm interested to see if he's going to try it again. He is. Let's see yeah, if they got in there. Short, comes, comes up, up short, short again. Not yeah, it's going to be third and goal now. Remember, QB sneaks not as easy this year in Madden 18, comparatively speaking to Madden 17. Uh, but if you've got two or three opportunities, you might be able to get a half a yard. Yeah. You would think, right? I, I would not be surprised if we see another QB sneak here again. Then again, he might just go ahead and give this thing to uh, our guy TJ Logan to try and get him some shot. Going to dock uh, the there eye, is, and there's yeah. the QB sneak, and he is in. There's the second touchdown, Aaron Rodgers with the sneak, and he's up 13-0. There is Blocky uh, here in his hometown of Miami. Actually lives in the Kendall area. Abbott Lopez got the block crew in the house as well. The Blocky crew with the mom, the dad, the cousin, the uncle. Everybody's here rooting on Blocky with the 14-0 early lead, early stages of the second quarter, Dave. Yeah, the whole fam coming out. That's, that's another fun part about how everybody who is playing in this is from South Florida. People can come out and support. We got tons of fans here. We got family, friends. This is what Madden's all about. It's a community. It's a lot of fun. M.G. Gusto with his second possession down 14-0. 
Had a blowout win in that first game. Now he's going to have to earn it. What can he do with Mike Vick? Looks like Blocky's not going to let Mike Vick just run around and have his way. Uh, he is going to have to mix things up and try to start throwing it. Mike Vick back in the gun. It takes off. Ooh, okay, speed. here's some space. Maybe you don't need to if you got Mike Vick running around like that. Holy cow, you see him take off? You know, that spin, that acceleration, mm. that spin move, it's just sick for a quarterback to try and, you know, uh, uh, something to think about also is if he set his ball carrier to conservative and he's running around with Mike Vick on a QB designed run, if he gets popped, he's not going to fumble. That's a huge asset. He knows that he can run around with Mike Vick, find space, make some moves, get some jukes and spin moves going on. But here he comes dropping back to pass. Oh, and he's sacked, taken down by Blocky. Anthony Barr with a huge sack there. Third down and 14. Huge play here. If he doesn't pick up a lot of yards, maybe punts it again. We'll see here. Third down and four. Gusto back in the punch quads. Mike Vick back there in the gun. Oh, he's got a long way to go here. Third down and 14. What can he do? Here comes the blitz up the middle. Nope. He's got a receiver. Oh, and he can't hold on to it. Ingram, I thought he could have taken off on the left-hand side. Vic now 0 of 2, completing the ball. Yeah, ni nice user play right there. A, a tough play right there because you have the low route, you have the medium route. Kind of did a good job of kind of spacing himself. We see he's in <laughs> punt safe. Yeah. Absolutely no more fake punts happening against Blocky today. I think, you know, that fake punt from his own 12. That's going to haunt Gusto that's, that's it. all day because that would have been a game-changing play if he was able to convert that. That's it. Yeah, if he, he converts it, he gets the ball back and maybe he ties up the score. It's 7-all instead. Exactly. He gets the easy turnover. Blocky turns it into points. It's 14 nothing, and that's where we stand right now. Blocky getting the ball again. His third possession of the game, and he is really adept at eating up clock. Chew clock, chew clock. He's really good at that. First and 10 for Blocky. A-Rod. Rodgers looking back. Yeah. Takes off. Be careful now. Get down. Gains about seven. We'll call it second down and three for Blocky. And until Gusto makes an adjustment on defense, Blocky's just going to run for seven or eight yards with Aaron Rodgers all game. You know, he needs to find a way. It's funny because we were talking about containing Vic. Right now, Aaron Rodgers is the mobile quarterback causing problems. There he goes getting outside the pocket again. He's going to try and hit the edge right there. And he does. Oh, oh a big, there, there's the big hit right there. Out of bounds there. That's what we were talking about. Be careful. Protect the ball. You have the lead. Third down and two uh, for Blocky at his own 49-yard line. Needs to get just across midfield. Third down and two for Blocky. Gun bunch. Weak there for Blocky. Aaron Rodgers in the gun, back to pass. Looking, got the crosser coming around, and he's got him there with Jackson. D. Jackson, Deshaun Jackson picks up the first down there. A great read by Blocky. Blocky is so under control. He had a route up the seam right there that he could have tried to get the ball into. Took his time, let routes develop. Like we talked about, he has a lot of speed on the outside. Let those receivers get some separation. Let those route combos do the work for you. Then you just make a read, make a throw. Not the biggest guys. Doesn't really do a great job of those guys going up in, in traffic, but they do have speed and they can get open. First down and 10 for block as we hit the two minute warning. And this is what you have to be concerned if you're Gusto him with the ball and leading and then chewing clock. Yeah, if, if Blocky gets a touchdown on this possession, uh, it's going to be really, really difficult for, for, for Gusto to come back here. Home to a field goal, maybe something can happen. You know, the second half, get a turnover. But right now, Blocky's got to be feeling really good about where he's at. Aaron Rodgers, plenty of time. No pressure at Nothing. all. Got a guy falling down. He's got, oh, pass is incomplete. He just gets it off. Avoids the sack there. It'll be second down. Gusto finally getting a ride. And that's the kind of defense that Gusto was talking to us before this tournament. I'm going to let my line rush. I'm going to drop the guys back into coverage. If Blocky's able to make reads, he'll beat me that way. But I'm going to trust in the secondary that I spent so much capital. Absolutely. Aaron Rodgers back to throw. Once again, a three-man rush. Here comes the corner off the side. There, It looks like the corner came late there, screaming in there. Third down and 10 on the incomplete pass. Good job of Blocky recognizing that and throwing it away. Yeah, new feature in Madden 18. You can have those guys who are in zone coverage break down, crash down on the quarterback. Nice timing right there. Good job explaining that. Third down and 10 for Blocky. Back in the in the gun. The gun bunch weak. Aaron Rodgers back to throw once again. Just three-man rush. One guy falls down. Here comes a oh. guy screaming off the edge again right there, and he gets the sack. It'll be fourth down and 16, and Blocky looks like he'll punt this one away. Good job of Gusto holding on and forcing the punt there. Dewey McDonald, the right outside linebacker, making the play right there. 
really, really huge stop right there for, for, for Gusto. He really, really needed that. Now, at the very least, he's going to have three timeouts. He's going to have, you know, about a minute left in, in this first half. Plenty of Plenty time. Of time. Yeah, absolutely. Go get some points on the board. Even if you have to take three right now, you don't want to do that, but you need to get something on the board. Cannot have that goose egg uh, going into halftime. Fourth down and 16, the punt right or at the sidelines, and it's out of bounds there. First down and 10 for Augusto. He's going to get his third possession here. And, uh, yeah, let's get this thing rolling and, and get a ball game. Let's get something positive going and see if we can get Vic on the loose. Yeah, so far, Block has done a great job of, of, of boxing up Mike Vic. And this is something we talked about with, with Quinn in one of the semifinal games. Guy known for running the ball, known for Mike Vick causing problems as we see just stuffed in the backfield right Christian there. Christian McCaffrey taking down, lost of about two or three, second down and 13, Dave. This is an even bigger challenge for Gusto than it would be for a normal Madden player. He's not accustomed to having to throw the ball, to have to run, no huddle, have to, to, to play with pace, really. As we see Mike Vick, there's no way anybody's going to catch him off that. That's a tough Throws throw right there. Oh, almost caught by his receiver, but dropped. Michael Vick failed so far to complete a pass. It's going to be third down and long for Mike Vick and Gusto. Oh, man, I mean, what do you do here, Dave? I mean, it, it's hard to complete passes. Yeah. He's got to kind of, you know, work. He's fighting left-handed, if you will, with the left-handed quarterback. Right. Well, you know, Blocky's doing really... Blitz. Yeah, here comes Vic. Let's see if he can oh, get Vic loose. Oh, had some room, but he did a good job. Hit Paul Richardson, and he holds on the first pass completion of the game. Timeout for Gusto. He still has two left under 40 seconds remaining. A nice read right there, and I think, I think he needs to be doing a lot more of that, which is getting Vic outside the pocket on pass plays, threatening the run once he does that, and then seeing if, if guys can get open downfield, because this draw right now, we've seen he's run it four or five times, there's nothing there. I mean, the, the draw has really, really been plugged up so far. Anthony Barr screaming off the left-hand side. They're a loss of four. Second down and 14 for Gusto. Tick, 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 under 30 seconds remaining. There he takes off. vic has got some room. Oh, here we Gets go. to the side. Oh, what a great tackle Shazier. there. Ryan Shazier yeah. probably just saved a touchdown there. And that's that's your that's such a big reason why Shazier is such a favorite in the Madden community. He's so fast. He's He's got so much speed, still has some of that hit power. He's really a fantastic user of the middle linebacker. Under 20 seconds to go. Gusto down 14-0. There's a look at Blocky. Basically said, I'm really high. The expectations here. I should win both matches pretty easily there. Oh, Michael Vick brought down a sack by Anthony Barr. His second of the ball game, 14 seconds left. A loss of four there. Gusto needs to pick up about another 20, 25 yards to get in the field goal range here uh, to... No, uh, I guess about uh, 20 yards. Yeah, really not where you want to be, ideally, right now, if you're Gusto after a sack on first down. Yet again, no more timeouts remaining. He just burned his last one. Yeah, you got to get something towards the sidelines, a little bit downfield. If you do keep it in bounds, you got to hustle up, get downfield, spike that ball, stop the clock, and see where you're at. Yeah, Blocky doing a good job with that cover two look back there, hoping that a lot of guys don't get deep there. Although uh -huh. you got, oh, oh my gosh, Michael Vick can't get it off again. Tick, tick. Tick, Joey Bosa coming off the left side, bringing him down that time. Four seconds left, three seconds left. Time's going to run out on Gusto. And that was a killer, though, those two sacks towards the end of the first half. And at the end of the first half, as you take a look live here at the stage, stage here inside of the Hard Rock Stadium, the Madden 18 Dolphins Club Championship presented by Wendy's. That guy right there, Blocky. Abbott Lopez with a 14-0 lead over this young man right here, Gusto. Yeah, we, we've seen we've seen Blocky do something that is one of the hardest things to do in competitive Madden. Contain Mike Vick. Well, yeah, and, and just be consistent. You know, on offense and defense, obviously his special teams in the semi was not what he would have liked, but he's been consistent in a game that's so hard to be consistent in. He doesn't seem phased at all by the stage, by the lights, by the crowd, by who he's playing against. He's been there. He's been here. He's, he's done this. There. He knows that he belongs here. He knows that this is his time to shine. He's executing so far. Spent a lot of time labbing. I know he's uh, he talked about you know rolling with uh, Eric Problem Rights crew on the top bat, and it's all paying off. He's got mom, dad, uncle, uh, and a lot of other people here, cousin as well. Uh, the kid from Kimball right now with a 14-point lead. He's doing really well, and he's got a lead. If you're Gusto, mm. is there anything that you can do off the Michael Vick run and, and, and the RPOs and the, and the run action? He's got to open it up and throw yeah. it. He's only completed one or two passes so far. Yeah, I think, you know, like I mentioned in-game, he needs to maybe veer away from the QB draw. It hasn't really been there. That being said, like with Barry Sanders, it takes one play. One play that's you need it. space with Mike Vick. You need me make one move, one spin move, one juke. You're gone. You're to the crib, and it's a whole different ball game. So I think that in going forward, Gusto is going to trust his plan. He's going to trust his offense. He's going to trust Mike Vick. What's biting him right now is the pressure that Blocky is getting with his front four. 
we know talking about building your team, Gusto does not have the cap committed to the offensive line that some of the other guys do. That's true. It's coming back to haunt him right now in the final. You talk to the real NFL players like Brady and those guys, they'll tell you what's the easiest way to get those guys off the spot and really, you know, put some pressure on those guys. Just the front four. Don't blitz him. Don't give him all that stuff. Just front four and drop your seven or eight guys in the coverage. And that's what he's done. And Blocky's up 14 nothing. Let's show you exactly how he got this lead here. The first half highlights and Blocky's in the orange color rush uniforms. Gets off to a good start. Hits his tight end right there, Dave. Yeah, nice read up the middle nothing too crazy his whole first drive was really just patient balanced waited for that corner route to get open he saw brandon cooks really nice play here's here's the big play though this is the fake punt from his own 12 gusto just a bit of an overthrow that hurt that, hurt. that really not only gave blocky the ball back on his 11 yard line completely shifted the momentum of this game after that we've seen gusto have a hard time getting things going this was one of those plays that i mentioned you saw Vic get outside the pocket let his receiver get open over the middle of the field but it's really just been a lot of pressure it's been tough for mike Vic to have time to throw the ball blocky just having fun out here <laughs> yes those two sacks at the end of the third quarter i just felt like that gusto would get a field goal and he came up a little short thought it'd be a 14-3 game Anyways, he's still down two possessions. I feel go, uh, it has, but you're still down two possessions. Right. So he's down 14 nothing. We'll see what he's able to do in the third quarter, but he's got to try to pick it up here uh, with his offense and Michael Vick. Like you said, I want to see more passing out of Michael Vick, but it only takes one if you can get to the edge and show some of that burst and speed there. Uh, that would really help his calls. Larry Ridley, Dave Grunfeld here live at Hard Rock Stadium for the Madden 18 Dolphins Club Championship. Let's go to the stage now. Back to the championship game as we get started here in the second half and the third quarter between Blocky and Gusto. Gusto Green, Vince Young, and there's the, the guy with the lead so far. Abbott Lopez, that's his government name, a.k.a. <laughs> Blocky, the 21-year-old from Kendall. He's got the lead. Couple of smiles, but he's dialed in and locked in, Dave. And I think in the second half for Blocky, much like in the semifinal game, we're going to see an appearance for TJ Logan, I think. He's going to have to kind of pound the ball. He's going to have to clock it out a little bit. We're going to see a little bit of a difference uh, in his scheme on offense. On defense, he needs to keep doing what he's doing. He's, get get he, pressure, make Gusto make bad reads. That, that, that's, that, it's a simple game when you put it like that. It, it is when you break it down in those terms. And he's the only guy that failed to give out any shout outs. <laughs> the only guy. Why? He says, I'll shout him out when I win. Yeah, he's, he's ready for that mic in his face so that he can really give some shout-outs for real. So I know mom, dad, uncle, and cousin would love the shout-out. And there's Gusto Green rocking the hoodie. Great first matchup in the semifinal. Got out to that 31-0 lead. Held on 31-6 there. Uh, did a great job in that first game. This game, a little slow out the gate. Michael Vick not getting loose like he did in that first semifinal against M. Brent Quinn. So he is down to that guy, Blocky, with a 14-0 lead. Let's go ahead and dive into the gameplay, if you will. Third quarter action here live from Hard Rock Stadium, side of Super Bowl 54, coming up in two years in 2020. Larry Ridley with Dave Grunfeld here for the Madden 18 Dolphins Club Championship presented by Wendy's. And they'll get started here in the third quarter. Blocky with the lead. I want to thank the Dolphins and everyone, the guys at ESL doing a great job. Dolph fans, go ahead and make some noise. Thank you guys for coming out. Got a lot of fans out here in the crowd giving, some, uh, giving away some, some controllers. I just saw a little kid. Just walk out with an Xbox. He just won an Xbox. That's, he's the, he's the biggest winner of the day right here. That's perfect. Gusto with the return, the opening kickoff, okay. and he's got okay. a little space. Okay. Can he get to the sideline? He can. There he Makes the guy miss. 20, 15. Can he get in there? He's got the juice, and he does. He gets into the zone. Makes a house call there. Gusto back in it, down 14, 6, spinning the extra point. He needed it, and he got it back in the ball game just like that 12 seconds off the clock and Dave Grunfeld <laughs> we've got a ball game. who needs Mike Vick when you just return kicks I mean it's not that difficult just go ahead and take it to the crib and that's no problem now he gets to show out on defense he gets to do what he's good at we got ourselves a ball game here Larry Paul Richardson taking it to the house there for Gusto and here's heel nice little uh -oh. juke there oh, good job fumble, ball fumble. and it's loose and it's recovered by Gusto Paul Krause huge. is the man in Madden. Huge, huge, huge play. That is the turnover he needed. That is the momentum shift wow. right there. He just stole the possession. So now we talked about that fake punt, right? It hurt him. But while wow, he's back in it, 14 to 7. Hands off this time to McCaffrey. Don't give McCaffrey the ball. Use Mike <laughs> Vick and let him make plays for you. No more giving McCaffrey the ball. Yeah, we'll stick to those QB runs from here on out. But, you know, what mental fortitude right there by, by Gusto. Like you mentioned, 
that fake punt was so brutal. Oh, critical. But, you know, going in, uh, to the end of the first half, he had that really good defensive stop against Block. He forced, forced the, punt, the punt, which, uh, you know, I think it started the, the momentum shift that we're seeing here in the second half. Gusto, when Dave and I talked to him in the pre-production meetings, and we were like, what's up, Vince? He's like, man, I'm feeling like a star. <laughs> right now, he would, he, he would be a star if he could tie up this ballgame and actually win this Dolphins Club Championship. Gain of one there. Third down and 13. What do you got, Mike Vick? Whatever you do, do not take a sack. Yep. At least stand field goal range and keep this thing competitive. Third down and 13. Gusto with the rock. He's got room on the left side. He hits the receiver. Ingram, can he get to the sticks? Comes up a yard short. What do you do here, yeah, Dave? Yeah, this is going to be a Fourth really interesting two. possession. There's Fourth our, there's our answer half. right there. No hesitation. No huddle. He feels like he has him in a mismatch right here. We see the safeties coming he's down. Room if he wants oh, to take he's going to do it. He's going to do it. Oh, with what the a spin move there. By Unbelievable. Mike Just make sure you get down. Don't get greedy. Here we go. There's the hoodie. He's rocking. He's got probably some Cardi B on, or some Gucci Mane That's or something. Right. A little flair, right? <laughs> well, you know, Blocky right there, everybody in this room knew what was coming on that fourth and two. That was going to be a Mike Vick QB drop. Stop? But you know what? Knowing what's going to happen is not executing on what's going to happen. That Mike Vick spin move is just too much. First down and 10 for M.G. Gusto in the red zone. The money's on. He's got a little crease there. He got wants him. it. Oh, what a dot there. And he's got Andre Reed. And that's a touchdown. And there you go. Boom. Just like that. He's back in it. And he's one point away, an extra point from tying up the ball game. And here comes Gusto. The snap coming back to his holder. Can he tie it up? Got some suspense here. Yeah, Mike, get the holder. Gusto's worried is. about the block, the even though he's roll. not in field goal block. I respect it. You don't want to have that happen to you on this stage. I completely understand. Got to hold it until just the right moment. We got. This is a completely different vibe in here yes. than it was for the first half. We've got a ball game. We're tied here in the third quarter. 3:06 to go. First two minutes of this quarter. Gusto with two touchdowns. Blocky with the rock now. He'll have his second possession. How about special uh, first teams possession today, actually of the first of the second half. How about special teams today? Special teams We've seen been very three special. Three kickoff returns. We've seen a fake punt attempt. There's, everything's crazy and in Miami. Fumble, People are and crazy a down here. The and a fumble. That's right. And a fumble on the kickoff. Five or six plays uh, in the kicking game that have been uh, critical uh, in determining the outcome. Oh, you got to throw it away there. And Rodgers almost takes the sack. Rodgers, seven of 12, 81 yards. He does have the touchdown throw. Second down and ten. If you look at you know, Gusto, he's only allowed like less than 100 yards. He hasn't played bad. It's been that fake punt that gave him the short field and then the first drive that uh, Blocky had a real good drive on. Second down and 10 for Blocky. Tied ball game at 14. Aaron Rodgers back to pass. Good job taking X away. Can he get up and get it? No, the defender cannot. Is he out of bounds? I think he is. Bounds, that was yeah. not complete. Tough, Brandon tough Cooks animation. did not get the drag and the swag. Yeah, right, right along that sideline when you hold possession catch. Sometimes it's a bit of a crapshoot with which animation you're going to get. That's the one that he landed out of bounds, incomplete pass. And now, you know, this is interesting. We have to see Blocky, who's kind of looking disjointed on offense, take a breath. Oh, oh that's there not he it. is. That's the user with it. Anthony Barr. Oh, Can he get to the sideline? No, he can't break the tackle. He's brought down. We saw it coming. I'm like, user, backer, yeah, bar, boom, got it. And I was just saying that Blocky just needs to take a breath. Don't panic. Get back to basics. Look at him. He's lurking. All He's lurking. Day. Saw it. All got day. it. Anthony Barr is a goon. That is a fantastic play on defense. Gusto has turned this game around wow. in a matter of less than three minutes. The two most confident players for the Dolphins in the club championship. Mike Vick takes off on a little draw action. We'll give him about four on that. Eight rushes, 26 yards for Mike Vick. Second down and six inside the red zone. Gusto on the move, looking to take the first lead of the ball game, Dave. Yeah, you know, Gusto has, has worked himself back into this game not in the way that we thought he would. This has not been the Mike Vick show. This has been field possession, special teams, and, and capitalizing. And defense, right, and capitalizing. Exactly right. Mike Vick takes off. Oh, Ryan Shea's ear lurking right there. It was like he was spying. He was ready for him, and he does, and he brings it down a gain of no yards there. Third down and six for Gusto. See what he can do with Mike Vick. A little RPO, run, pass, option. What is he going to do? Gusto in the bunch quads there. Playing the run strong right here, bringing a bunch of guys down into the box. Going to make him beat him through the air. That's a Absolutely. smart defensive strategy. Oh, he had it to the left side. He had a little crease there. Uh, no gain there. Gain of actually a loss of one. Fourth down and seven. Of course, you kick the field goal yeah. there. Got to take your points. Absolutely. Take your points. You've, you've, you've proven to yourself that you can stop him on defense. 
There it is, three 31 points. 31-yard field goal up, and it is good. And for the first time today, Gusto has the lead over Blocky, 17-14. One minute, 43 seconds left here in the third quarter. Larry Ridley, Dave Grunfeld here live from Hard Rock Stadium for the Madden 18 Dolphins Club Championship presented by Wendy's. And there's Earl Thomas III off to the races. He's got a little space, <laughs> but he's brought down there on the 35-yard line, Dave. Yeah, the special teams today have just been amazing. A lot of space to run, one spin move creating even more space. Really, really, really impressive on, on special teams for both guys. This is going to be interesting. This is Blocky has missed going to Burbank for the Madden Classic and the Madden Challenge Twice by now. one game. Now he's facing more adversity. He needs to come back, settle himself down, and execute on offense right now. Here we go. We'll see if he settles down. First down and 10. Aaron Rodgers looking. Got Brandon Cooks. Good job of getting down. Not trying to get any extra yards. I guess that fumble on the kickoff spooked them a little bit. Oh, it would spook me as well. Absolutely. And that, that's exactly the type of play I'm talking about right there. Five-yard game, possession catch. That's Don't it. overthink it. Move the ball downfield. Matriculate the ball downfield. Matriculate. That's oh, it. Old-school terminology. Get down. Fakes to Logan. Aaron Rodgers takes off. Has a little space. Send him. Going to oh, take off. And he's going to come up about two yards short. It'll be third down and two. Aaron Rodgers got nine rushes today. How about that for Aaron Rodgers? And, you know, he's... About he's, as many as Vic. I was going to say, he's he's the, the Mike Vick of, of Blocky's team. But on that one, he actually playmaker his receiver downfield. Had a step downfield that he had committed to running with Rodgers already. Third down and two for Blocky. And his gun bunch. Weak. Got Rodgers. Here comes her. Defender, can he get up and get it? Oh, I thought he was going to use her. Micah Hyatt there, he does not. It's going to be fourth down and two. If you're blocking here, do you think about punting it? or you? I mean, it's competitive, Matt. You I think go you, you got to right? go for it. I mean, fourth and two, any competitive Madden player uh, should feel confident being able to get two yards no matter where you are on the field. Uh, this is a huge play right here. Let's see what he's got cooked up. To and the he flat. Oh, Ryan St. comes up short. He did not get it. We're teetered. Oh, oh, dear. oh, he gave it to him. <laughs> I thought he came up about a half a yard short. Yeah, those Madden referees and their Ooh. spots can always be a little bit tricky. A real quick hitter to Shazier in the flat. Didn't overthink that one either. No. He, he figured, you know what, I'm just going to make this happen, and hopefully I'm going to get a good spot, and he did. Logan dives across, picks up about three seconds down and seven. I'm sorry, he didn't get that first down. He, he didn't get that. I thought that oh, was short. Back. Yeah, second down and seven. Yeah. Logan dove over on the first run there up the middle gain of about three yards second down and seven for blocky trying to get back into this game and take the lead was up 14 nothing 17 unanswered from gusto aaron Rodgers looking deep Whoa, under pressure almost had oh, that user pick away. there at the end. oh that was and you see you know i mentioned earlier crashing down with those defenders as the quarterbacks get out of the pocket that's why those last couple of throws from aaron Rodgers have been so erratic late pressure forces the ball high third down and seven for blocky gun bunch to the left Logan offset to the right-hand side. Rodgers, plenty of time. Going to take off. Ooh. Oh, and he just overthrew him. He had a corner out there for Deshaun Jackson. Now we've got fourth down here. I don't know, Dave. I think maybe you do punt here. Fourth and seven. Not easy to pick up. Not fourth and very long, but that is in the fourth and long category. Yeah, no, that, and that was unlucky a little bit right there. That was not a bad read. He did have a man open. Unfortunately, not a great Missed throw. Them. Yeah, just not a great throw from A-Rod right there. But, yeah, you know, I mean, anything fourth and 15 or under, and we see right here, I think he may have drawn him off sides. You know, anything that's that's fourth and 10, no. or I'm sorry, it's a false start. False start, yeah. Fourth and 12 now. You know, competitive Madden guys, like I said, they feel confident getting these fourth downs. He's around midfield. Even if he doesn't get us, he feels like he can make a defensive stand, hold Gusto to three. Well, a couple weeks ago up in Seattle, we saw the Air Force controller. That's right. Killer, Killer Mike. Mike. That's right. Yep. Complete last, last six or seven fourth downs. That's right. And they were all like this, long, no gimmies. Oh, he Whoa, might have those toes. Toe drag swag. Toe drag he swag. He did not. I just thought the defender was going to jump up. Micah Hyde was there in the trail position. He wasn't able to get him up in the air. First down, great job as we head into the fourth quarter by Blocky, trailing by three at 17-14 in the fourth quarter now. Dave Grunfeld. Larry, we have got ourselves mm. a football game right here. Huge fourth down conversion with the toe drag swag. Very, very impressive. Seeing uh, A-Rod roll out right again. There we go. Nice got read. Get back left. Got plenty of time. He's going to run again off. with A-Rod. Get down. Exactly. Very, very smart play right there. Again, this is what Blocky's good at. Don't force it. Don't rush it. Take your time. You're blocking your backs. You're blocking tight ends. You're having plenty of time to throw the ball. Just make a good read. This thing will come down to whoever has the ball last. Second down and one. Blocky. At the 26-yard line, Aaron Rodgers back, and he's got Ron Shazier. Yes, the linebacker slash tight end. 
Out to the little flat, little swing pass out there. He's got him. It's a gain of about five or six first down for Pocky inside of the red zone, Dave. It's like we're back out in Pop Warner, huh, Larry? We got guys playing both sides of the ball out here, a little linebacker tight end combo. I love it. Look cool. at the stick skills by oh, Gusto. Right. Oh, and he got him again on the sidelines. That corner route has been there. Went from the right side back to the left side this time. D Jax, Deshaun Jackson, is keeping those feet in bounds. They're first and goal for Blocky inside the 10. Back in the gun bunch. Back off set to the right hand side. Aaron Rodgers looking, looking, got time. And he's going to hit Tyree Hill. Does he get in? No. Oh, he got in barely. Got the ball just over the goal line. And he is in for a score, 20 to 17, pinning the extra point. Great drive there by Blocky with some critical throws, a couple of great throws on the corner routes, and then that one right there in the middle of the field, Dave. Yeah, that fourth down conversion was so huge. That was so, so big for him emotionally, also just getting himself back into this game and the score. But another situation here where if you're Gusto, you got a lot of time left on the Plenty of time. Here. Plenty of time, but you also don't want to score too fast. You don't want to get points on the board and give a guy like Blocky two, three minutes to, to, to get back into this game and have a you know, game-winning touchdown or a game-winning field goal. All right, here we go with the receiving by Paul Richardson for Gusto. He takes the ball. Down by four. We go down here inside of five minutes here. This is it. Fourth quarter. Nitty-gritty time right Nitty -gritty here. Nitty-gritty time. This is it, man. First down and ten for Gusto. Gusto, of course, and that bunch quads there. Actually, Gun Bunch gives it to McCaffrey. I've said it all along. Why are we rushing <laughs> Christian McCaffrey? Three carries, negative eight yards. He's back on the line of scrimmage again. You live and die with Mike Vick like you said you were. Second down and 12 for Gusto today. Yeah, you know, McCaffrey has not been able to find any space, like you said, especially between the tackles like that. The, the most success he's had with McCaffrey today has been throwing the ball to him and getting him getting him open downfield. He scored a touchdown earlier on that, that deep post with McCaffrey coming across the middle of the field. That was the first game. That's right. Absolutely. Third down and long for Gusto. Third down and 13. Blocky doing a real good job. I mean, you look at Mike Vick, 11 carries, about less than 30 yards. You'll take that every Super day of the week. Super impressive. Super impressive. There he is. Oh, great route there. And that's what he does. He looks to Paul Richardson over the middle on that post or the dig route after he buys some time with Mike Vick. That's his that's his pass out of the gun bunch. Yeah, absolutely. And it's something he does really well. This is another real football comparison. He's throwing his guy open. He's throwing that ball as his receiver is making his cut on that deep end. That's like a real quarterback move right there. That's very high-level stuff right I there. don't have a lot of hair, but I will pull it out if he runs Christian McCaffrey again. <laughs> Rod Mike Vick. Run Mike Vick. Larry, you need to hop Pass in there. Mike yeah, Vick. hop in and coordinate no for him. No more Christian please. McCaffrey, hop in please. There and tell him what's going on. <laughs> Second down and 11 here. The Dolphins having some fun here inside of Hard Rock Stadium live here for the Dolphins. Madden 18 Club Championship presented by Wendy's. And there's Mike Vick taking off. Can he okay. make the man miss? Oh. He does. Right between two defenders. 12 carries and once again less than 30 yards for Mike Vick, but you got to continue running him. That's what you have there. That is your weapon on offense for Gusto. Third down and five under three minutes to go. You're right. He's trying to run clock, trying to chew it and not leave a lot of time for Blocky. Third down and five. Watch oh, out. Coming on the left hand side. He barely gets huge, the ball off. Huge animation there to be able to get that incomplete pass. Keep this at fourth and five instead of a fourth and 11, fourth and 12. Completely opens up his playbook. He can, he can run a lot more right here. And you saw, you know, on, the, on that, that QB draw a couple of plays ago, Mike Vick had space. He made a move and shook two defenders. Mm -hmm. Blocky has three, four, five defenders surrounding Mike Vick at all times. That's how you rush a quarterback that has those legs there, an athletic quarterback. You don't want to bull rush though. You just, oh, actually, you want to bull rush them and kind of keep them in the pocket there and keep them contained. Mike Vick, he's, he's got set. space on the left hand oh, side. Oh, and he's oh, got he Andre Reed breaks the tackle. Oh, and he's down inside the wow. ten. Every single wow. time when he needs a big play, he's looking across the middle on that deep dig or that post route, and he got Andre Reed, the Hall of Famer, there deep inside the red zone there. Now we're going to get down to the two-minute warning. First down and ten. Here we go. How about Gus? This, is it. this guy has too much swag, man. He completes this pass. He sits back in his chair, folds his arms. No big deal. Does not feel the pressure whatsoever. Now it's time for Blocky to get that red zone defense ready to go. Larry, this is about as good a final as we could hope for. 
Confidence is off the charts. He told us that. Gusto, there he is right there with the black hoodies. He says, look, Larry, got to come to the fight with confidence. And fight is a big term in Madden. All of these guys, they implore their buddies and their friends, fight. So this is what we're doing. We're asking Blocky, fight. We're asking, asking Gusto to fight and get this thing going. We want a heck of a finish here live at Hard Rock Stadium for the Madden 18 Dolphins Club Championship. Dave, second down and eight here. Clock ticking. And, and clock ticking, and you know, he, you don't want to just score right away. You don't want to give him a minute and 30 to, with three timeouts left to come back and score. But at the same time, you can't really futz around too much. You no, really need to you need score. You got to get in the end zone. A, a field goal is not going to get it done. So uh, I expect him to be aggressive here on the second down. I think he's going to look to the end zone. There he is. Second down and eight oh, for Gusto. Takes off. Mike Vick's got a little space. Oh, he should have picked up the first down, but that's only he's got two downs yep. to pick up two yards. Third down and two. Will Blocky use a timeout here? I think he's going to pull a Belichick and just let it run and just have a staring <laughs> and, contest. And, and save those timeouts for when he's going to get the ball back. <laughs> I think he feels confident that, you know, it, within this play or the next two plays, he's going to get the rock back. He's going to have a little bit of time left on the clock to, to make something happen. If you're Gusto, don't get too cute. Get the first down. But, man, it'd be nice if you could run four, you know, three, four plays here at the end and maybe not score here. Hands it off to Christian McCaffrey. Oh. What are we doing? Oh. Christian McCaffrey. Five carries, negative 11 yards. I'm pulling out whatever little hair I have in my head right now. Stop I'll running, Christian McCaffrey, please. I'll tell you what, Larry, that was almost a ball game right there. That was a big hit right there on your guy, Christian McCaffrey, who, yeah, he continues to pound with, with He's good McCaffrey. in real life. Not, He's not having a good game not today. Not having a good uh, Dolphins championship right here, that's for sure. Presented by Wendy's, of course. Fourth down and five. Here we go, play of the game. Mike Vick got some space. It's oh, all is picked is. up by the there old man, Paul Kraus. Can Mike Vick make the tackle? He does. He pushes him out. Look, he's got three timeouts. What wow. a pick there by Paul Kraus. I thought he should have ran it on the left-hand side. Prob probably picks up the first down. Oh, that hurts yeah. Gusto. You know, mm. from fourth and five, even with a guy like Gusto, who's so good at the QB draw, you got you know, you feel like you gotta you gotta throw the ball in that situation. Out. A tough pass into the end zone right there. A big, you know, five yard chunk here on this first down play. Yeah, he needs to get some stops right here. I gotta respect him going for it. No, he went to the no end stops. zone. There's no plural. He needs a stop. <laughs> That's right. This is it right here. This is the stop he needs. Be See, careful. He's 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 got two of the three down that he needs right here. This is his last chance to get the ball back right here. All right, under 40 seconds left. Blocky with the ball, third down and four. Can he get the stop here with that last timeout and we can have a fantastic finish. Third Throw down it. and four, and he's going. Oh, and what a completion. Tyreek Hill there, he's trying to get the ball out. He does not. Huge first down pickup there to Tyreek Hill, and I think that will just about do it. Blocky with the huge completion on third down. Babe. And now, uh, Blocky, that's a championship winning play right there. Gets to come out in the best formation in football. Under center, victory formation. <laughs> huge win for Blocky, man. No, what a game. No victory formation in the shotgun? <laughs> not today. Not in Madden. But Blocky, I mean, I'm, I just I can't say how impressed I am with, with his defense, man. To, to lock up Mike Vick the way he did in this game. Come through with a huge turnover on the biggest play of the game. Gusto has one last time out. He's not going what to use it. What a game. Great Give sportsmanship it up. Give it up. there. Gusto and Blocky, what a final here in Miami. Actually, technically, Miami Gardens. That's where the stadium is here at the Hard Rock Stadium. And there is your Madden 18 Dolphins Club champion, Blocky, with the win. He is moving on to Orlando, Florida, the last weekend in January. Congratulations to Blocky. He did it in front of his dad, who's right behind us. Also had his cousin, his uh, uncle here as well. Mom is here. Great job from the 21-year-old from Kendall, beating another guy from the South Florida area. Great, great, great game between Gusto and Block. Yeah, really nice back and forth matchup. We saw Blocky come out early, really strong. Gusto used the special teams to get himself back he into did. the game. But you know what? Blocky took the lead, 17 Took the lead, unanswered. came back and took the lead, but Blocky, he came in here with the confidence. He came in here knowing that he was the guy to beat, and he showed up and executed. And, and on defense, the ability to just box up that Michael Vick five wide spread, what else can you say, man? Congratulations to the young man. Very, very happy for him. He has moved on to Orlando. He's going to be taking on the other NFL club champions. All 32 NFL teams are going to have a champion, but right now it's Blocky for the Dolphins. Wow. I, I see his mom and his dad. They're happy. We talked to their mom and dad, his mom and dad, about it when he was playing the Collegiate Championship. Right. I'm like, dude, you're playing for money. He was in school, and they're like, look, you know, we want you to really go to school. 
Then he started winning, <laughs> bringing home checks. I see his dad back there. Dad knows exactly what I'm talking about. Your kid's in school, but he's making money playing Madden. Let's hear from the Madden 18 Dolphins Club champion. He's standing by with Douglas Esquire with Lockheed. Douglas. All right, man. Hey, let me tell you what a hard fought battle. Somebody make some noise for Blocky right now. Blocky, how'd you pull it out right there, man? How was it? It was rough with those tricky turns, but, you know, I have to still keep fighting, and I just remember, you know, sticking my game plan, and it worked out. I'll tell you right there, they were driving, they were, you had that great lead, and then special teams blunders again, but hey, you persevered. How'd you persevere? Let me know. Come on, tell me about the offense right here. I hear, I saw he was going uh, flat to clouds each side, so I know I had to try to hit something in between it and over the middle. And that's what I tried, and it worked out eventually later on. My man, look at this. Hold this. Hold this for you right there. Look at that right there. Dolphins champion. You're representing my team right here at Pro Bowl. Right there. Are you ready, man? Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, your Dolphins champion right here. Madden 18, Dolphins champion presented by Wendy's. Bro, you're going to the Pro Bowl. Are you going to practice? What's the deal? What, what are you looking to improve? Uh, specifically, that type of defense, a uh, hard cloud. So I'm just working on that. I need to get better on that. Ladies and gentlemen, one more time, right here from Hard Rock Stadium, your Dolphins champion. Make some noise for Blocky. Yeah, make some noise out here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to go ahead and kick it right over to Larry Dave. Yeah, Douglas Esquire.